Now if you've got one of these rainwater tanks, one of the problems you're going to face is to know how full it is. And there are various ways of doing it. Most people just go knocking along the tank and it gives you a rough idea of where it is. But if you want an accurate level, then uh, you either need some high-tech stuff or I've found a fairly low-tech method on how to do it. What I do is I use one of these, which is just a common or garden stud finder for finding uh, wooden or metal studs in a drywall. And uh, I find if you set it, my in this particular one, if I set it on deep wood, uh, that does the trick for me. Now I'll just show you how it works. Now you put it, you put it on the tank, and then you switch it on, and you should get a beep. That means it's calibrated. Now I move down. You get a few false readings on the way, but you'll find one you'll get is pretty solid. See that one? It's not wavering. Now it goes off because of the ridge in the tank, and then it comes on again. There we go. So if I go back up again, there it is again. You see? So go down. That's all water. There's water. So then I can just take a pen or something and mark the spot. And then uh, quite a good idea to put the date there. And so you can measure. Now another thing that I do, I know that this level uh, was after 54 millimeters of rain and the tank was basically empty which is down to the tap. So if I measure from the tap to where it went, that's 102 millimeters, uh, centimeters. So that means 54 millimeters made 102 centimeter gain in my tank. So I know now if I get one millimeter of rain, I get more or less two centimeters of height on the tank and then what you can also do is when you're irrigating work out how much you're using per irrigation and then you can plan uh, how to use the water because you know that uh, you'll be using so much and if you get some rain it goes up by so much you can keep a record of it now that's that's about it it's a very simple method and if you enjoyed this video or it was useful to you please like and share it and subscribe to this channel because uh, there'll be more videos coming. Thank you for watching.